Hi everyone today, we're going to take a look at the 5 best 5x7 speakers on the market for this year. First we're going to show you our 5 best picks, then we'll talk about what you should look for before buying a best 5x7 speakers. You can find timestamps and links to all the products we mention in this video down in the description below. Let's get started. One of the most noticeable upgrades you can make on your car, without spending an exorbitant amount of money, is to upgrade your speakers. And a pair of 5x7 speakers is a great option, because you can get them at different price points, and it's a difference you'll hear pretty much instantly. So, let's take a look at a few popular options and see what the best 5x7 speakers are. Number 1. Boss Audio Systems BE5768 Speaker. Kicking things off with a budget pick, the Boss Audio Systems B5768 is a great choice for anyone looking to upgrade without spending too much money. They come with an excellent feature set that ensures you'll notice the upgrade to your stock car audio. First things first, these are four-way speakers, which means they can get you the full range of audio, with nothing missing. This means that the highs will be crystal clear and crisp, while the bass will be powerful and precise. And everything in between will be excellent as well, which is just the case with the B5768. They really sound great regardless of what kind of music you're listening on them. The build and materials used are great, too. The cone is made from polyurethane, which means it's going to last a good while, and provide excellent sound. Then, you've got a piezoelectric tweeter, which is more resistant to overloads than a conventional one. You've got rubber surrounds as well, which connect the cone to the basket, and is a great pick for a durable material. These are some decently powerful speakers, too. You're looking at a peak power of 150 watts per speaker, which is very good. They can get pretty loud, pretty quickly, which is perfect if you enjoy your music a bit louder when you're out for a drive. Lastly, we must mention the looks. Even though they do come with grills, these are speakers you might want to leave uncovered. Being a part of their Rage series, they come with a subtle blue LED illumination which looks pretty good regardless of placement. All things considered, if you aren't keen on spending too much money, you'll love the B5768 5x7 speakers, because they get you a lot of bang for your buck. Pros. Very affordable price. Full and rich sound. Great design. Cons. The sound will distort if you turn the wattage to maximum. Number 2. JBL Club 8620 Speaker. JBL's Club Series is meant to offer a great sound without being as expensive as the company's more premium models, and the Club 8620 hits the nail on the head in that regard. They sound very well, and they cost as much as a pair of decent mid-range speakers, so let's take a closer look at them. The Club 8620 is a pair of two-way speakers, which means you only get a woofer and a tweeter. Now, in most cases, this would result in a sound that's oriented towards only the highs and the mids, with everything in between significantly lacking. However, thanks to JBL's tuning, there is a fair amount of mid-range in the speakers. No, it's not on the level of three- or four-way speakers, but it is surprisingly full for a two-way speaker. On the other hand, the highs are very clear and you can hear just about every high note, and the bass is powerful, but not overpowering. Were positively surprised by JBL's tuning, they really did a great job. The power is pretty decent, too, with an RMS power of 55 watts each, and a peak power of 165 watts each. Yes, they're far from the most powerful speakers out there, but they're just right if you don't want to use an amp just to be able to run them. Then we've got the build and design. This is a pair of all-black speakers with a JBL orange touch in the middle. They look rather subtle, and they'll fit within every car aesthetic with relative ease. Of course, you could cover them up, but honestly we'd leave them out in the open, they look really good. When you take everything into consideration, JBL has really done a great job with the Club 8620. Yes, we would've liked it if at this price, they were at least three-way, but the sound tuning is good enough so that's not a big problem. Overall, we'd have no problem recommending these if you want a reputable brand and decent sound quality. Pros. Subtle design. Good sound and great tuning. Decent power. Cons. Only two-way. Number 3. Rockford Fosgate P1572 Speaker. 
Rockford's Fosgate P1572 is priced like a mid-range speaker set, but in terms of performance and overall sound quality, punches way above its weight. It's a great speaker set that looks stunning and checks all the boxes in regards to sound quality, build quality, and of course, looks. First things first, these are two-way speakers, and are part of Rockford's Fosgate Punch series. As we would expect from Rockford, you don't get that mid-range lacking situation, thanks to the tuning, and the sound is pretty full and rich. Pair that with the excellent highs and powerful lows, and you're looking at an overall excellent sounding speaker. Of course, adding more actual speakers like a mid-range will always sound better, but we've got the feeling that Rockford is making the most out of the woofer and tweeter that the P1572 comes with. Speaking of that, you're looking at a mineral-filled cone that's made of polypropylene and has been injection molded, with a butyl rubber surround, paired with a pay dome tweeter. This combination not only sounds pretty good, but is also very durable, too. Moving on, we have the build quality. Rockford paid a lot of attention to this, because they have a reputation to live up to. You also get their popular FlexFit basket, which instead of getting you mounting holes, gets you slots. This adds a lot of versatility in terms of mounting, because you can fine-tune the position, and even get away with it if your car uses non-standard screw positions, too. Last but not least, the design is pretty good. The all-black color looks very good, and it gives the speakers a very premium look and feel in every way. They look like they cost at least three times more than their actual cost, which is always a nice thing. In short, P1572s can easily be considered as best 5x7 speakers, full range, in terms of value. Pros. Stunning, premium-looking design. Good sound quality. Flex-fit basket for mounting flexibility. Cons. No grills included. Number 4. Alpine SPS 517 Speaker. When you start looking into the higher-end 5x7 speakers, you'll come across Alpine's SPS 517. This is a set that is actually cheap for what it is, and is one of the best options if you want a reputable pair of speakers that sounds very, very good. Let's start with the sound quality itself. You might lower your expectations when you find out these are two-way speakers, but there's a lot more to it, because Alpine have done a great job with these. You've got a 1-inch silk dome tweeter, paired with a polymica cone woofer, which is a pretty great combination. Everything sounds pretty great, from the punchy and powerful bass, to the clear and crisp highs, and, surprisingly, everything in between, too. The bass is slightly overpowering and will not suit everybody. But if you like speakers that are pretty much bass cannons, they're pretty much right up your alley. Then, you've got the design. In traditional Alpine fashion, these are all black speakers with nothing but a blue logo beneath the tweeter to indicate that this is an S-series speaker. There is also the silver tweeter, which is a nice accent point. They do look pretty good, and it's far from a situation where you'll have to cover them with a grill. The downside is, unfortunately, build quality. Alpine really could have done a better job, because there is a lot more plastic on these speakers than there should be. Yes, you get slotted mounting instead of single screw holes, which is nice, but they're very far from confidence inspiring, which shouldn't be the case with a pair of speakers that cost this much. You will have to be very careful when mounting these, as the entire mounting system can be easily damaged. If it weren't for the build quality, we would certainly be recommending these as a great higher-end choice for a reasonable price. But unfortunately, unless you're very careful about how you install these, there are better options. Pros. Great sound quality. Subtle design. Very powerful. Cons. Build quality is just bad. Fitting them could be an issue. Number 5. JL Audio C2 to 570X Speaker. People who are looking to put a high-end pair of two-way speakers in their car should give JL Audio C2 to 570X a shot. These are a pair of extremely well-built speakers that sound phenomenal, and even though expensive, they have a lot going for them in many regards. Let's kick things off with the most important aspect, sound quality. In that regard, JL Audio have done a brilliant job, even though hardware-wise you only have a tweeter and a woofer. These are two-way coaxial speakers, which means that the highs and the bass should be impeccable, and they are. Everything is crystal clear, and instrument separation is like you'd never heard before. 
The bass is powerful and punchy, without being overpowering, and it's very accurate and precise. And even though there isn't a mid-range speaker, there is a surprising amount of clarity in the mid-range, too. Overall, the sound is exactly what you'd expect from a high-end pair of speakers. Moving on to the build quality, JL Audio have done a great job here as well. The speakers are built very well, and there's zero compromises in terms of the build. These are easy to install, too, with slots instead of single hole screws, so you get a bit of versatility in terms of setting them up exactly right. The C2570X looks very good, too. The design is a combination of black and silver, with a subtle blacked-out JL Audio logo on the tweeter itself. Honestly, we'd have no issues not covering these with a grill, and instead we'd let them be seen. The colorway works great with just about any interior color, which is nice as well. The one and only downside of the phenomenal C2-570X is the price. These are expensive, and you can get close to this level of sound quality without spending this much money. But if you're looking for perfect sound paired with great design and excellent build quality, all in one, this is it. Pros. Incredible sound quality, especially considering these are two-way speakers. Build quality is great. Beautiful, subtle design. Cons. Pretty expensive. 